Hey folks, I just encountered something since it's Bandcamp Friday. Uh, I don't know why, I don't know how long this has been around, but this page that says you cannot download music to your iPhone, uh, I don't know when that started, but there is a way around it, and it's pretty simple. First, actually this is the only thing you actually need to get, open up the Siri Shortcuts app, it's just called Shortcuts. You may never have uh, seen it before. You're literally going to download a, uh, we're gonna add a shortcut that just is called download file, all right? And then, um, you've got Safari, whether you like it or not, because this video is specifically for iPhone users. We're gonna go and up here and request desktop website. And there we go, this is a familiar screen, right? Unfortunately, if you just hit that download button, just tap it, um, it'll take you back to the other screen. But if we hold down on it and go to share at the bottom of this menu, and then go to wherever I put it, Download file, there it is. I don't know why this is necessary to get the zip file, but it is. Um, while that's going, uh, so I, you can't add MP3s to your Apple Music library from your phone, that's never gonna happen, but there is a version of VLC, believe it or not, for iOS, and it's, it's okay. Um, it's not like, uh, I haven't really researched in to see if it's built on the original VLC. You might just have to trust me on this one, because I'm in the basement. Um, <laughs> come on, you can do it. I promise, uh, I did eventually get that zip file, and it works the first time. Here's the proof. There it goes. Yeah, that's how you get around that.